On, on the bridge have a design life of around 30 years and the bridge is 30 years old now so the, the joints have uh, reached the end of their serviceable life. Um, so the program to take undertake the works now so we can undertake the work in, in a, the least destructive manner as possible. Uh, there is some urgency um, due to some localised failure of the joints which we've had to undertake running repairs over the last six months or so. Um, so it, it's uh, in, in important that the joints are replaced before we get a, a full failure, uh, which would mean the road be closed and the work would have to be undertaken under the emergency um, arrangements, which would be highly disruptive to traffic flows. It is more important than ever to invest in the A55. This half a million pound scheme will ensure the safety of the travelling public for years to come. This project is just part of a whole of ongoing operations, maintenance and improvement works that have been undertaken by the Welsh Government. In the first quarter of last year alone we invested around 30 million in the strategic road network with major resurfacing projects on the A55 at Eulow and the M48 near Newport. Preparation work as possible um, before we close the carriageway. Once the carriageway is closed, we start ag demolition to remove all the concrete around the joints. Um, once that's complete, we can remove, remove some of the reinforcement bars and lift the new joint in. Once the new joint's landed, um, we fit reinforcement bars and formwork ready for concrete. Um, we then concrete using a fast setting concrete, um, which allows it to cure. Um, much quicker than your standard concrete. Once that's complete, then we um, waterproof, uh, re-waterproof the bridge deck and the abutments. Um, that will take about 24 hours to cure, which then allows us to resurface, white line, and open the carriageway. number of structures of similar construction in terms of the length of span and the types of joints that have been installed. They're all of a similar age, so we have a programme of joint replacements uh, for those structures, uh, notably at Carrier Viaduct on the A5 just outside Wrexham and Goat Inn Viaduct uh, which is a few miles to the west of this, this bridge. Um, so there's a programme where we'll be doing Carrier Viaduct next month uh, and uh, Goat Inn Viaduct uh, programme for roughly this time next year. Uh, so we plan these works uh, a few months in advance um, involving our subcontractors, um, involving the client. Um, we then come up with a programme which is agreed by the client and our uh, subcontractors. Um, when we hit site then we follow that hour by hour programme um, and it ensures everything runs as smoothly as possible. We work 24 hours a day, 7 days a week to ensure that the project is uh, completed on time. We also have uh, contingency in place for things like weather delay and breakdowns. So far the um, project's gone really well. We've finished eastbound on time um, and reopened the road as planned. Um, we've now started on the, uh, the westbound carriageway uh, and so far we're on programme uh, to finish uh, on time again.